setting up your new Sky Keybox is easy. Just follow these seven simple steps. First, put the batteries into your remote. Look for the diagram inside to tell you which way up they go. Put the viewing card into your Sky Q box. Slide it in, chip first and facing up. Next, you'll need to connect your box. Start by plugging in the satellite and pink HDMI cables. Then, put the other end of the HDMI into your TV. Now, put the blue power cable into the box and its plug into the mains. Turn on your TV and select the correct HDMI input. After a minute or two, you should see a blue screen. When it disappears, press the home button on your remote. If you have two satellite cables, skip to step five. If you only have one satellite cable, you'll need to follow step four. Scroll down to settings and enter 001. Then press select. Go to LMB type, SCR, then press select. Scroll left to LMB type. Now restart your box by switching it off and on at the mains. Connect your box to the internet by going to settings, setup, network. Select your Wi-Fi network and follow the on-screen instructions. If you're connecting without a password by using WPS, once you press the button on your router, press this button with two arrows on the front of your box and hold for five seconds. Next, pair your viewing card. At this point, when you press the home button, you should see this message on your TV. To pair your card, go to settings, System Info, Viewing Card Number, and select Setup. Then, follow the on-screen instructions to access all your channels. Finally, pair your remote. This will let you adjust the volume on your TV and switch it on and off with your Sky Q remote. Do this by pressing 1 and 3 together. Then, follow the on-screen instructions. If you have Ultra HD as part of your package, to enjoy the best possible picture quality, you'll need to set it up on your box. Find out how at sky.com slash ultra HD. Now, when you press the home button, your SkyQ setup is complete. For more information, go to sky.com slash help.